You know, I've had to defend myself about ingredients for probably eight or nine years of the 14 years I've been in business because there have been so many challenges to fragrance candles. Um, the first one was caused by the importing by large chains of candles made in Asia and those candles contained wicks that had lead in them. The lead was in them to keep the candles straight when they go along the production lines. The wick will not go over with the heat. So when they're mass produced, lead wicks work for them. I don't know how much is in the air, but uh, it made a big amount of fuss right around Christmas season every year. It still does to a less extent than before. Actually, years ago, there's a great big window right here that you can't see, but people drive up into uh, the parking lot and park there. And I'm watching this huge Hummer drive right up in front of my window, actually blanking out the sun, it was so big. Um, two ladies got out. One was rather well known, the other one is someone as well who is known. And they came in the store, they wanted to uh, try and make a candle for themselves. Uh, and the one lady said to me, do I have lead in my wick? Well, that's all I had to hear. I'm looking out at this Hummer, a yellow one, facing in. And by the way, it had nothing to do with the governor nor Maria Shriver, but other people have Hummers as well. I just looked at her and I said, I don't have lead in my wicks and I don't drive a Hummer. Needless to say, she didn't make the candle. Now, secondly, soy. We can get into a story about soy. The only ones who are making 100% soy candles are smaller companies. Most companies have always used soy. I've been using soy in my candles for years. 100% soy does not last. It's a food additive also. It can spoil. And it doesn't hold fragrance well. The combination we use in our candles is soy and a Vaseline petroleum. Now my mother had put Vaseline petroleum on my butt from the age of one to six or whatever it was, and I'm still around and I'm 69, so I don't think it hurt any of us, and I don't think it's going to hurt any of us in a candle as well. This combination works perfectly as a pool to diffuse the fragrance. We use almost twice as much fragrance as a lot of candle companies use. The pool is perfect in the glass we use. Everything has been developed to make our candle work perfectly in your room. That's all we want to do. And all we want to do is have the best fragrances available. We work with the best fragrance houses as well.